You hear that? Hello? Wait, hello. Yo, what is that? I'm actually freaked out. Guys, I'm freaking out. I can't see anything. Let's go to bed. You cannot sleep when someone is in the room. We feel in this song in the back. Yeah. This feels kind of ominous if you ask me, and I'm down for this adventure. You ready to get jump scared with me, guys? Because if you say no, you better click off this video now. So what is going on, guys? This is Ryan here, and welcome to an indie game called Mothered. Now, I don't know anything about this thing other than hearing people say that this is a very interesting and good horror game. It's got that good story compacted down into one complete adventure, which of course we're going to be doing for this video. I said at the start, this is going to be that longer, less edited episode, and for this one most specifically, I'm actually sticking true to it being a true longer less edited one. You're still gonna see a couple of zooms, jump cut sound effects here and there, but guys, I gotta cut down today. Main reason for that, guys, is because under my stairs, holy crap, there is so much trash under there. And you know what, man? Today is the day where I stop putting off tidy in that thing. I mean, you're seeing the video on screen right now and how crazy it really is under there. Yeah, your boys put that off for long enough. It's time we actually tackle this. You wanna see more longer, less edited stuff? I think you know exactly what to do. Let's go ahead and get this. Press enter to start. <laughs> That free content warning. Sunday evening. This is gonna be your warning, guys, okay? Before we get into this thing, this is all coming up. Left click to accept. Father, there's a storm approaching. Right on cue. We can only hope this will be the last. Left click to wake up. Hey. Mom? Press WSD to move around. Use the mouse to look to. Hold space or uh, right click to open the interface. Okay, ooh, we see that. When the interface is active, left click on the objects to interact. Okay, I see that. So, for example, here. We can click on that. Oh, sorry, Liana. I didn't mean to wake you. I must have been thinking out loud again. Good timing. We're almost there. I know that the surgery took a lot out of you, but I think getting you back home will make all the difference. So he was talking about the storm, I suppose. It's important for you to be with mother, to remind you of how things used to be. If all goes well, I have faith that you'll be back to your old self by the end of the week. You've been through a lot. I'm just glad we got you out of that place. It wasn't good for your head. So we had surgery. I guess we were in the hospital or something like that. Ooh, look at us driving along the scenery, though. We got that golden hour coming, and you got your phone. Can't you want to snap some pictures? Interesting idea with the interface, how you hold right click, and then you can click on the different things. So not really much more we can do. This father in front. Do we talk again? You know, Liana, father turns down the radio. Uh, I have a good feeling about this week. Okay, that's positive then. I've been so busy at work recently. To tell you the truth, it shames me that I don't have as much time to see my family as I used to. But I want you to know something. Please tell me you love me, man. Everything we do is for you. Aww. So he's a loving father. I'll give you a call on Thursday evening. Remember to keep an ear out for my call. So Thursday evening, we'll try and remember that one. The house is just up here on the right. Just in time for nightfall. Yeah, I see that. So we're pulling up. No darkness for me. I'm afraid of that anyway. Oh, what is this? Sunday night? Well, here we are. The storm has picked up, so you'd better run in before you get soaked. Press shift to run. If it's too dark in there, be sure to look for light switches. All right, Dad. Oh, I almost forgot. Your mother left a box for me somewhere in there. Could you bring it out to me before you head to bed? I'll be waiting right here. All right, Pops, I hear you. We don't have a flashlight. Woo! It really is a stormy night. My goodness, Pop Train goes nowhere. The flood is insane. Okay, I'm going, man. We're gonna truly sprint through this thing. My feet are getting soaked. So here is the house, and we have to be with Mother here. Okay, so he spoke about bringing a box outside uh, with the light on there. Got a small area here. Uh, I don't know what that is. I don't want to go down there. Let's go in the house. We've got all the time in the week to do this, right, guys? So open the door. Here you go. Front door handle. Push that. Hey, let's go. We need that light switch on. You flip the hallway switch on. So it's kind of like a role-playing game, I think, where it kind of tells you the things you do. And I think we might have multiple choices. Flipped on the kitchen light switch. Here we are. Kitchen, nice and shiny. So place is nice and clean. I like what I'm seeing. The fridge contained food, but you do not need to eat. Dude, my belly is rumbling right now. So we'll go upstairs. Uh, hey, mom, anyone here? I think it said we flipped on the light switch. Open the door. So this is for the bathroom here. Okay, sanitape tape over the mirror. That's a weird thing to see when you come in a place. I don't really want to go down here. It's so dark. Here we go, here we go. There's a door, there's a door. Push it. I'm not allowed to enter his room. Okay, we won't do that, no problem. This way here. Yo, I hate how dark this is. It's kind of freaky, so Liana's room. Stay out or face my wrath! Okay, okay, I see that. Where's my light switch? I don't remember where it was. Wardrobe. This is my wardrobe. It contains clothes. How about this room at the end here? Door handle. Now that does nothing. Wait. What is that? There's a fire burning outside, you see? 
out the back. Uh, maybe we should investigate what that is in just a sec. Let's try and find this box, though. You pick up the phone, but nobody's there. Well, that's generally what happens with phones. We put that back down. All right, guys, we're still trying to find the box that our uh, father was talking about. And there's a note here. It's for you. Welcome home, Liana. I hope you made it here safely. Sorry I'm not there to welcome you personally. I haven't been feeling well the past few days, so I've had to go to bed early. I'll make it up to you in the morning. Okay? Love, Mom. Aww. P.S. I left a box on the sofa for your dad. Could you please bring it out to him before he drives off? He needs it for work. There is a lamp just behind you. It should help. Just behind me? Uh, where? I don't see no lamp, though. Is she talking about this? You touch the lamp. There you go. So we've got light on this side here. Now, I can see behind. That ain't a box, is it? Uh, you are forbidden from touching this record player. It's father's prized possession. And here's the box on the sofa. There's a cardboard box here. Father wants you to bring it out to him. So we pick that up. It's quite heavy. Well, that should be no problem still, though. We'll run that thing out. Can we see out the window? We just see that fire in the distance. We can't interact with it. So I guess it's a thing we just observe for now. All right, brave the storm, man. Woo! I'm getting soaked with this thing. Hey, Pops, I'm coming for you. Can you turn your headlights down just a bit? I, I can't see anything. Yeah, man. Great, you found it. You give Dad the box. Be sure to say hi to your mom for me, okay? And please, be patient with her. She's been through more than any of us. I'd give you a hug, but I can't let you see my face. It wouldn't be safe. Looks like this storm is picking up. You better run in and get to bed. I'll be sure to call on Thursday night. Good night. Wait, what? The freak was that exchange of dialogue? You don't want us to see his face? Okay, I mean, I've been sitting in the car with you. Like, you don't think I peered over your shoulder? Inside we go. Let's uh, close the front door. You know, shut the storm out. I guess all we can really do is go to bed, right? We've looked around the house. Nothing else was here, so bedtime sounds the best option for me. Here we go. Click on the bed. You have traveled far today. You are exhausted. You climb into bed and you go to sleep. And then we take our nap. It's time for Monday morning, but... Why is this so ominous in between these transitions? Like, it's making me feel so uncomfortable. There's that barn out there, you see? So it was a barn where the fire was at. All right, open that door. Now, can we open this door? I'm still sealed up. I guess we go greet mom. Our brother's room, still not allowed in there. Okay, you hear the birds singing outside for such a stormy night. It's much better. Hey, mom, how are you doing? Let's talk. Good morning, Liana. It's me, your mother. Oh, my apologies again for my absence last night. I needed to take care of something. I know what you may be thinking, and you don't have anything to worry about. You're home now, and that's what is the most important thing. But anyway, I do hope you slept comfortably. I understand that you may be feeling a bit confused after your operation. You've been through a lot, Liana, but as I'm sure you noticed, your room was just kept the way it was when you left. After all, we we wouldn't want you to face your wrath, would we? I always love that little sign on your door. It's so you. I hope that being back in your own room made you feel a little more comfortable. For today, I think you should just take it easy. Catch up with your dear old mother. First things first, I've prepared breakfast for you. It's your favorite. What is my favorite? It's been such a while since I had that good breakfast, I don't even remember. What the freak? Is that oatmeal? What is that? Nutrients, your favorite. Wait, just straight up pure nutrients? What the freak, though? Um, uh, thanks, Mom, for cooking me my favorite meal. You ingested all the ingredients? What's with this weird terminology? Hey, Mom, she's like standing there by the TV. Um, we'll interact. You ate the whole thing? That's interesting. So I understand that your memory may not be intact after your operation. And so I, I was thinking it could perhaps be helpful if I was to show you around the house. Maybe if you got a tour of the house you grew up in, it could speed up your recovery. Okay, feel free to explore the house. Okay, now, when she talks, why does she straight up, like, start throwing shapes? You know what I'm saying, guys? How does she out you? Like, stop doing that, though. What the freak? All right, Mom, you just stand there like that all day. Uh what the freak? The downstairs bathroom has been boarded up. It was broken, so we thought it was best to not let anyone in. I know how much you used to love getting into places you shouldn't be. You must not try to break in here. Then again, it's not like you ever listened to us. You always were a rebellious one. But this is for your own good. After all, we don't want you flooding the place. That would be a nightmare. Anyway, meet me upstairs and we'll check on that brother of yours. Why does she move like a robot? It's like... What the freak is happening? You know, maybe we should check up on our brother. Honey, oh, I have great news. Your sister is back. Hopefully this time for good, I think he said it. Just transition. Um, he's been quiet ever since you got sick. Now he spends all of his time on his computer, talking with others like him. We never get to talk anymore. And whenever we do, he may as well be speaking another language. It's like he's in a completely different world. But our boy is very smart for his age, that's for sure. If you ever need advice, I'm sure he wouldn't mind you knocking on his door. He'll never allow you to go in, however. Okay, let's move on. All right, Mom. Yo, my mom is jacked up. Is she in the bathroom too? Do I really need to... 
There you go. You can see both of them in shot. What's she gonna tell me in the bathroom? Maybe about the, the thing on there? This is the bathroom you'll be using. As I said, the downstairs one is boarded up and you are forbidden from entering. Also, I hope you don't mind, but I've had to cover all the mirrors. It is again for your own good. Is it to do with my accident? My face or something? My father also, we couldn't see his face. I don't know. And that brings us finally to this door. It leads to mine and your father's room. You are not to enter this room. We keep it locked. All right, but as we trust it isn't necessary, we have trust in this family. So maybe the door is still open in that case? That concludes our tour. We go on to the Monday evening. Why am I getting a tour though, if I'm your daughter? So I guess she's trying to like remind me of everything. Mother has left. You see, yeah, the sun's starting to sand right there, so we can't go in here at all. Uh, let me check my own room a second. Okay, uh, looks good. It's it's a room after all, so sick. As much as I want to try mother's room, I also don't at the same time. Uh, she's not in there. I might knock on the brother's door, try and get some advice, so here we go. Nope. I'm not allowed to enter his room, so knock on the door. We got nothing back. There was no answer. Is mother downstairs? Um, I don't see her really anywhere. Maybe I should go out the front of the house, see what's popping off, get the door handle. Hey, mom! Where are you? Oh, she's here. What is she doing? I was looking at this beforehand. Um, why have you got music coming from your, your body, though? I don't really get it. It's like a moist floor. It's a lot of water, I guess, from the rain. So, shall we talk to her? Liana! You startled me. You weren't meant to sneak up on me like that. But I was right in front of you, though. Oh, I missed that line. It skipped it. How very special. You always used to love sneaking up and spooking me. Oh, it's starting to look like you're getting back to your old self. Who knows? Maybe getting a tour of the house help recover some of your memories. Okay, tell you what. Tomorrow, we'll go take a tour around the outside of the house. I'm certain that once you see where you grew up, you'll be back to yourself in no time. Does that sound good? I think it does to me. You know, I'm down. Look at this sunset. We used to watch the sun go down together all the time. To tell you the truth, I was worried we'd never get a chance to do it again. So that's kind of a nice thing. Perhaps all the sacrifices we made really were worth it. Sacrifices in terms of what? This one looks especially beautiful though, doesn't it? I mean, I got my back to a mark, I'd see. Come on, it's starting to get cold. Can I please look at the sunset though? It's about time you get to bed. Oh, why did you see the sunset, man? Okay, Monday night, so it was a tour around. Oh, whoa, 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 why am I still outside? This looks extremely ominous out here. Let's make a move for the house. Hey, mom, why does time flash so quick? Like, I get no time to respond. Look at this, I'm running into the darkness. I can't see anything. There's a small gate here. We can't even open that. Maybe that will lead around the back of the house. So for now, we're gonna go back inside. I don't get this weird atmosphere. It's very unsettling. Like, why are all the lights off in the house? I kind of need to see where I'm going. There you go, we flip the light on down here or upstairs, should I say. That light, you flip the kitchen light on. Um, I don't really see anything. Let me get this one on too. So mom's not down here. I guess we simply go to bed. There's something very off about this house. It's very unsettling. We can hear some kind of humming coming from over here. It's almost like it's coming from outside. Uh, don't see any fires going down. I kind of want to check every room. So she ain't in the yeah, she ain't in the poop station. I'm glad about that. Let's just go in our room. So let's go to bed. You cannot sleep when someone is in the room. What? What the freak do you mean? Um... Hello? <gasps> Yo, what the freak is she doing? Liana, our angel! Just one more thing. I've had to do a lot of things that I have regretted. What is going down? So please, no more. For the sake of this family. Just get it out. Sorry I had to bring the mood down before bedtime. Oh, it's okay if you hate me. It's normal for girls your age. I just really hope you enjoyed your first day back home. Why is the nighttime gone so ominous? Get some rest. I'll tuck you in. I can do it myself, Mom. Just like before. Okay, I, I don't trust Mother. Her m That's a creepy shot. I see that. Okay, I'm going to bed. You get into bed and Mother tucks you in just like before. Is it like disagreeing or something commences? I don't know, Tuesday morning, we're awake. Something very weird about this game, guys. It's so strange. Let's just go downstairs and see what Mother's doing. In fact, before that, let me just try this. You knock on the door. There was no answer. Something's gone bizarre already. I can sense that. So we can't go in our brother's room and he never answers. Mother, what have you done to him? Oh, good morning, Liana. I hope you're well rested. I may ask you to exert yourself a little more today. Yesterday evening, I mentioned that I would show you around the house grounds. Well, I've given it further thought and I think we simply must do it. If there is any possible chance of you getting your memories back, we need to take it. I think it's important for you to know what goes on here. Okay, I'd like you to meet me down by the place we watched the sunset last night. Alright, my, my, my breakfast. Hey, my, my belly's rumbly. Where my 
what tummy can they get for? She actually got food. Let's go, let's go. Nutrients, your favorite. You ingested them. Straight up. Thanks, ma. Meet it down by there. So, okay, we see her right there. If I open this door, what the freak is happening, guys? She's already down there. Wait, wait, hang on a second. The back of the house actually opened. Oh, and we can see what's back here. That is interesting. So we can see the barn on the hill up there. There's nothing else for us to really do, so we should probably go greet Ma. Hello, Mother. Uh, do you have any concerns about the rising water levels around here or not? Ah, you made it. This is our orchid. It means a lot to me. All right, while you were in hospital, I became very lonely. I never got to see your father. The music's just going over each other. And your brother, he closed himself off entirely. What you knew in that hospital bed made me feel so powerless. This orchid became one place where I thought I had control over what was happening. To have responsibility over the creation of life. It's a divine gift. A gift inherently infused with sorrow and failure. To look at this orchid, you don't see all of the heartbreak that was involved in creating such a beautiful life. Creating an environment where they can thrive and come into their own. It takes time, but once you get it right, you'll forget about the hardship that brought you there. That is kind of true. Spending your energy on helping them grow, only to have to dispose of the failure? That's where our hope comes in. All right, Mush, she's getting kind of dark with this talk, and I have hope. Me too, I think. Can we see the growth space though? Let's continue. Meet me at the path near the side of the house. It's time for afternoon. These transitions are weird. Mother is waiting near the grave. The graveyard? We're kind of being led this way here. Uh, hey mother, where are you actually at? Is this the graveyard or is that it? Cause that looks like it to me. Did I perhaps go the wrong way? Yes, it was. I was thinking to myself, maybe this little door thing has some use. So talk to mother again. The path behind me will take you to the graveyard. We keep the gate locked. I like to go in there every Friday evening. Although I've been growing less fond of going in there lately. With a future as hopeful as ours, I don't feel the need to cling to the past. What? Not anymore. Um, hey, what's in that graveyard, Mom? Time to move on with the tour, I mean. Meet me behind the house. There's one last thing I need to show you. Yo, I got questions about that graveyard, for real. What is going down? Why would this house have a huge graveyard like that? Mom should be back here too. Wait, she said meet us behind the house. I'm back here, Mom. Oh, wait, there's a walk path to this side and this is where Mother's standing. So the barn is up the top, but Oh, it is for that. I thought the gate was a separate thing, so talk to mom. You see that barn up there? I'd love to, but I can't turn my head. I truly hope you'll never have to see what's in there. Wait, do not enter the barn. Survivor knows, do not enter the barn. Come on, let's go inside. It's getting late. There's something very twisted happening with this game. Look at this, do not enter the barn. Mother has left. We don't ever want to go in there. We can't even try the gate. Okay, maybe we should bear that in mind. Now, let's know. When we came home on the Sunday evening, there was a fire going on in there, right? What's happening with this whole week system? I'm getting a bit suspect. Can't try the gate for the graveyard either. And I ain't gonna look at the orchid, so let's just go inside. Hey, mom, I have no plans to go in that barn. You know, I'm gonna be that good daughter. So let's go talk to her. She's doing something over there. She washing her hands in four frames per second? Uh, mom, your, your jacket stuck around your thumb. You know that though? Like let's try talking. By the way, I've been meaning to ask, how was your father doing? You spoke to him when he drove you here on Sunday evening, didn't you? Ever since you got sick, he's just buried himself in his work. That's why I barely get to see him these days. He makes a quick visit every Friday night just to see how things are doing. Oh, he's just so determined to make things right. Off to bed with you now! Okay, mom. I can go to bed though. Uh, it's getting dark. I don't like this game. I feel like something really dark is gonna happen. Mother has left. She just zaps away every time and she just leaves us here by the bottom door. It won't even let us try and open these doors now. It's like, we know they're locked off, so there's no point even trying to access it. Does the TV happen to work? You do not need to watch the TV. But what about if I want to though? There are many things in life we do not need to do, but there are many things in life, however, we would like to do. How about we start favoring that, you know? I don't see anyone there. Uh I've thought of the most marvelous idea. Let's spend a day in the orchid tomorrow. We will get up bright and early and spend a day picking apples until the sun sets. Just like we used to. What do you think? Um, oh, you always jumped at the opportunity. You and your brother used to love competing to see who would pick the best ones. Don't tell him I said this, but I always thought yours were the best. Speaking of your brother, have you gotten a chance to speak with him at all? I'm certain that he's just as thrilled to have you home as I am. He just shows it in his own way. I hope you felt okay today. Anyway, go to bed. What is with this music, bro? 
Something is really twisted with this game, and I'm scared to see what happens when we get to that point. I'm gonna open my door. Yo, this is weird, man. What the freak? I might actually close my door. I don't want to see this, you know? I really don't like any of this. How she just stands there. So, all right, Ma, we'll be seeing you in the morning. Go to bed. It's been a long day, but now it's night. You must sleep to progress. It keeps saying something at the end. My brain has to... It don't have time to read. It's what, on Wednesday morning? Sun is up. We must have got that early morning. Um, all right. Nothing more we can do in here. Let's uh, go downstairs. Hey, Mom! I'm up. I'm ready to go. Let me see if brother's awake. Knock on the door. No answer again. So our brother still hasn't responded, and it's Wednesday morning. Mother barely seems concerned, to be honest. Uh, let's talk to her. Good morning! Hope you're ready for a day in the orchid. Better to start bright and early. If you head down there, there is a small shed within the trees. Make your way to that shed, and I'll explain what to do. Oh, it'll be just like the old times. There's breakfast on the table, if you feel like you need it. That's an interesting thing. She said, if we need it. So we don't necessarily need to eat this. Uh, shall we eat it? I don't know what happens if we don't. I'm actually going to eat that thing so we add those again. Or rather, we ingested them. Let's go down to the orchid area. Let's see what we got down here. This water is still completely flooded in the area. Yo, I'm already thinking, like, is there multiple endings to this thing? You know how she said, if you need it. What about if we didn't consume the nutrients one single time? I wonder if we could still progress through the game. We're looking for a shed. This might be it here. Very damaged and destroyed, like... The freak, this is barely a shed, mate. You want this looked at? You found me! It's always so peaceful out here at this time. What better time to start a hard day's labor? If you get started now, you should be done by the afternoon. I think eight apples should be more than enough. Just pick up the basket in the shed. Come back and speak to me when it's noon. Okay, so we take the basket in the shed, picked up the apple basket. Now we just need to find eight apples. So I can see one right there looking for nice, red, luscious apples. Pick that one. Let's see where the other one's at. This is kind of a nice experience, you know. Very peaceful out here. Mother wasn't lying. Apple on that tree. Aha, give me that second one. Third one on this one. No, nothing coming through. We scope all around the place just in case we find the sweetest, most delectable apples. Apple number three acquired. There's one per every other tree. There's a fourth one here. So we're making track, man. We're making good ground here. There's four. Come on, where's that fifth one? There we go. Apple number five. Where's that sixth one? This truly is peaceful, you know? My mother said that line. I was kind of half thinking like some things are going to get kind of creepy. But now that I've spent the time out here to just bask in the sun and let the warmth touch my face, she hear the birds chirping with nothing in the distance here. I think she's kind of on something, guys. There we are. There's apple number six. Two more to go. Come on, trees. Grow through nice and well. The water and the ground. Oh, it's moist. It's great for you. Giving you all the nutrients you might need. That's a high one. We're going to have to jump for that one. So number seven. One last apple, and we return to mother. Hey, there we go. It's Wednesday afternoon, so it progresses straight through. What do we do now, then? Can we see a lot more blue in the sky? The sunset has left. Mother's still standing over there, so let's try and talk to her. Also, wait, what the freak? Why is that sensor? Do you see this? The freak is going on. That's the graveyard, too. Um, oh, okay. Hey, Mom, what are we doing now, then? Well, look at you go. I've never seen someone get a job done with such determination. You work like your life depends on this. Suspect. Isn't it so great being out here in the real world? When I'm out here, it makes me feel alive. It connects me to this world. The smell of the fall air, the crunching of the leaves beneath my feet. If I didn't have those things, tangible experiences, well, it would be nothing more than just another menial task. Something I would do simply to get it over and done with, so I could move to the next thing. Sorry. I often get quite reflective when I'm out here. Anyway, place the basket back on the shelf where you picked it up. Then you should take a rest. You've earned it. Okay, thanks, Ma. So put the basket back here. You place the basket of apples on the shelf. You hear your mother rush back into the house. You take a rest as per mother's request. And it zaps us to evening, no! Yo, I'm dead. You are now arrested. Mother's gonna break our neck any moment right now. This is just getting weirder as time goes on. Number one on my list of things to do now. We must find a way into the graveyard. There's a light permeating and that statue or whatever that is back there. Something weird is happening with it. The first truly bizarre thing other than mother. Yeah, you know I have to investigate that. But in the meantime, let's go take that rest. Unless maybe we did it. Maybe that's why we were still there. We must have fell asleep. So exhausted from everything that we've been doing. Wait, there's a basement here too. Does not open for you. The heck? What does that even mean? That's such a bizarre statement. Uh, let's go inside. Close the door. Hey, mom! I'm back inside. What's the plans for the eve? She's there. She's there. Hold on, hold on. By the downstairs toilet? Let's speak to mom. I'm sorry I had to rush home. I didn't get a chance to see what you've collected. I'll do that later. You worked very hard today, despite not feeling like yourself. You should be proud of that. Get some rest. So, we're done for the evening again. All right. Whoa. Liana? 
Can I ask you something? When I talk about these things you used to do when you were younger, you don't remember any of it, do you? It's okay. You just don't have to pretend like you do. It's late. I'll speak to you in the morning. And then it's night time. Why aren't you trying to tell me? What happened in the past? You know, past self, you should get to bed. All right. It's so dark, man. I hate how dark it gets in these corners. Bro, are you still not awake? You knock on the door. No answer. There's just nothing. Please don't be there. She's not there. Thank goodness for that. I kind of want to open the door, but I really shouldn't. We were told what to do or what not to do even. So it's just us in the room. Let's close the door. You have worked hard today. Mother suggests that you should get some rest. You notice how we're doing exactly what she's telling us to do? That makes me kind of wonder if there is a way to rebel in this game. You know, a way to see other sides of this world. So we open the door. Um, I'm gonna try- you know what, skip it, man. Let's try the door. I am forbidden an entering mother and father's room, so we can't even try and open that door. Okay, go in the bathroom. You do not need to go- we haven't been for the toilet in like four days, dude. I would probably get that looked at. Wait, where's mom? She's not here today. Uh, mom? Are you, you nearby anywhere? The cabinet is used for storing pans, trinkets, and pots. Mom must be outside real early in that case. She's nowhere to be seen in the house. It's a note for you. Liana, I started to feel unwell last night. I have had to go back to bed. Your breakfast is on the table from mom. She didn't say love from mom. Nutrients, your favorite. Yeah, good. What now? I wonder what's wrong with mother. What? There was no day for Thursday. Yo, that felt to me like if we spent the time to explore, that would have been when we could have found some bizarre things. Do we go back upstairs? Father calls today. Um, she's like looking out the window kind of blissfully in, uh, yeah, T-pose. Liana, about yesterday. If I came across as irritated, then I am sorry. I hope you can forgive me. I just need to have hope. For what? You're still not well, and it's not fair for me to push you. How selfish I am to think that this is about me. Run along, my angel. I just need to think things through. This is just flying by. Thursday evening is just zapping away. Okay. Mother's disappeared. Father's calling. Oh, finally, we can talk to him about what's been happening? Black red sky outside. Wow, all right. Um, answer the phone. You pick up the phone. Hello? Liana! That's you, isn't it? It's your father. I told you I'd call. So, how's my little angel doing? I am as busy as I've ever been here at the office. I have a good feeling about this next thing I'm working on. I really think this could be the one. Uh, hey. Can't you see I'm on the phone? What do you mean? To who? Someone's talking. To my wife, of course. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Sorry about that. Certain people are starting to get far too interested in my business. Okay, where was I? Oh, oh yes, there's a reason I called. Other than the fact that I said I would, of course. Your mother rang me from the orchid this morning. She told me that things aren't too well. I am so sorry to hear that. I just hope you know that it's nothing to do with you. It's just... It's just what? I thought things were going okay. She's been through hell lately. I'll be coming to visit her tomorrow night. And as much as I'd love to be able to spend time with you, it's just not safe for either of us. What do you mean it's not safe? What is going down in this world? Anyway, you hear the shift? Try not to fight it, will you? Fight what, father? There's nothing I've had to fight. Wait, goodbye. You put the phone down. Yo, mother? That man's optimism. What is going on? There's something very, very weird, guys. It's very- this is one of the most eerie games I've seen. It's not often you see a man's greatest strength also become his greatest weakness. There's writing on the wall, and while he may have lost many things, his hope is not one of them. What is this down here? Wait, what the freak is that? Um, mother? Come outside. There is something I need you to show me. I need to show you, excuse me? What do you mean? Yo, there's something down there, that text. We're seeing through things. Um, okay, mom, I'll meet you outside. She was determined that we were the ones that had to show her something. She's right by the orchids. Do I really want to go there? Maybe we should just talk to her to see what's happening. The nights have been cold lately. Have you noticed? These are the kinds of nights that inspire gratitude in having a home like ours. She's getting very, very, like, thoughtful. Um, this one feels especially chilling, though, doesn't it? Not really, I'm not gonna lie. I want you to walk directly towards the moon. You'll meet me out by the roadside. Yo, what is she talking about? Mom, you're making me feel so uncomfortable. Is she talking about this way here? Walk directly to the moon? I don't want to. I really don't want to. I don't know if she's talking that way or here. This is the roadside, if I'm correct. Is she maybe standing somewhere alongside here? Let's go down a bit more. We can walk. Wait, it's just water. We're walking down by the roadside. This is not the direction of the moon, though, but 
We can move fairly far this way. Look at this. There's a gate back there stopping us from being able to leave. She didn't mean here, guys. She meant her direction. So let's move back. So you mean like straight out like there? We just walk into this water or marshland, whatever this is? Straight to the moon, she said. Um... Oh, I see a Wayne down there. Why would she want us to walk all the way down here? Look, I'm just standing there, though, bro. What the freak? Mom, can you stop being like this? You're freaking me out, man. What do we see out there? It's just a shoreline. Look at her just standing there. Let's talk. I'm going to look from this angle here. Here we are. This is as far as you can physically go. I want you to do something for me. I want you to do something for me. I want you to sleep here tonight. I need you to show me. I need to know. But I know you will. What? What do you mean? Just here? Dirt. Sleep. I can't. I'm clicking the dirt. It won't allow me to sleep. Mother wishes for you to sleep here tonight. You lie on the ground and wait until morning. What is happening, man? Why? You feel well rested. How, man? How? You just slept in moisture. Bro. You don't feel well rested. You feel moisturized. Let me just go this way a second. There's a break in the fence. Uh, oh wait, it's shielded up. This is like a driveway, maybe where our father would have pulled in through. What is happening with this game, guys? Should we go back to the house and see what happens? Okay, as I'm getting closer to the house, are we hearing the music come back in? It should be peaceful, but it's very broken. It's not complete anymore. It's almost like the facade of this being our house and everything being perfect and it being great for us to be home. It's all starting to shift a little bit. Should we talk to our mother? Hey, mom, want my nutrients, though? Nutrients first. Don't even care. Thank you. We didn't talk to her? Yo, what the freak? Report to mother for your next objective. You hear the change in dialogue now? Wait. I will allow you into the graveyard. Just for today. Um, do we just go ahead, then, in that case? Let me try my brother's room one more time. Hey, bro, you want to come to the graveyard with me? I think he's already at the graveyard, guys, if you know what I'm saying. Look at that. The gates are just burst on open. Oof. Let's see what's back at the graveyard, then. Why does this place have its own graveyard? Clearly, Mother knows all of the people in here. They're related to us somehow. Finally, we can see. Look at this. It's censored. Error, 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 error. Errors everywhere. Feeding could risk core or proceeding could risk core instability. You must not proceed. Whoa! I must proceed. Yo, we're getting mixed messages. Why? You must proceed. Should we? Whoa! I mean, we can always replay this game if we need to, right, guys? So object blocked to prevent potential conflict. This object has been mental blocked to prevent any potential conflict. Are you sure you wish to continue? Sure. Wait. What is this? Forbidden object warning! Observing this object may lead to a core conflict. We demand the immediate servicing of any unit shown to suffer the core of conflict. Are you sure you want to continue? Yo. Liana's grave? Level up! What the freak? It's my grave! Our angel. Okay, this game got weird. We will never give up on you. Whoa, she's in black. You know what that means, guys? Is this a funeral? We're gonna talk to her. How does this make you feel? You can speak if you like. Mom, is that you? Hello, can you hear me? You don't have anything to say? I I'm here! It's like we're a voice trapped within something. Why can't you hear me? Uh, that's okay. You don't have to say anything if you don't want to. Uh, am I dreaming? I must go inside. Your father is coming to visit, and I need to prepare for his arrival. Dad, he's here too. Please, go to bed. What is going on? You're probably wondering what's going on. Okay, well, we'll talk about what just happened in the morning. This game is getting trippy, man. So, we can talk, but we're like trapped within ourselves. Core conflict contained, control restored, next objective, go to bed. You feel a drop of water run down your face. Wait, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. What does that mean? We can observe it, it's processing. I, I want to see what our response is now. Forbidden object. Backup core, core initializing? What are we? Our angel. We will never give up on you. Yo, what the freak is going on? This is so weird now, guys. You hear that? Hello? Wait, hello? Yo, what is that? I'm actually freaked out. Guys, I'm freaking out. I can't see anything. Please no, please no, please no. Don't do it, don't do it. Oh, 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 what's going on up there? Who is that? Is that mother? What the 
Yo, she's up in the bedroom communicating with someone. Is it aliens? I can't go behind the house, Matt, or I can. Let me barricade off. I could go back here. Let me just try. I shouldn't be doing this, but I've got to see if the barn is barred off. It is. It is. We can't go there. What is happening in the house? So mother's communicating with someone. Some kind of darker force. You can see the light beaming through from upstairs. Look at that. Let's go inside. This is a weird adventure, guys. This is so, so weird. Go on, Hannah. We're in, we're in. I'll check in here anyway. Look at all the light beaming through. Close that door. Skip that. I don't want aliens coming in here. Yeah, you can see the light coming from under the door. There's light in here too. You knock on the door. Don't mind those two. This happens every week. It's like they're living in different worlds entirely. So we spoke to him. I'm going to knock on the door. You hear what appears to be arguing? Isn't... It isn't any of our business. Wait, any... Our or your? Okay. Should we just sleep then? How am I going to sleep whilst I'm hearing that bickering going on? Mom, Dad, do you want to keep it down? It's been a long day, but now it is night and you must sleep to progress. There's some kind of weird, like, loading system happening in the bag every time we sleep. I just wish I had more time to read it. So we're awake, guys. Fantastic. <laughs> what the freak is going on? You're awake, Angel! You're not well. I just wanted to tell you that you can stay in your room today. I don't need you to do anything for me. I want to go out. Your father will be here to pick you up tomorrow evening. So, until then, just wait in here, okay? We're doing everything we can to help you. You know that, right? That's my girl. Level up, continue to... Be with mother. That's our objective? What does that mean? I can't look out the window. Our objective is just literally be with mother. I ain't going to bed. I'll try to open the door again. Wait. She wasn't here this time. Let me try the door. I am forbidden to enter this room. It's mother and father's room. Yo, what is happening? Where is she? Will he talk to us again? Let's see. There was no answer. That was all the speaking we got with him. Hey, mom. Angel, you startled me. I told you to stay in your room. Please. It's for your own good. She's pushing us back. Enigma technologies I read. Be with mother. Mother is hiding. Where? Why would she be hiding from us? She down here? We're playing like hide and seek. We have to find mother. This is our objective. She's telling us to stay away, but our core is telling us to do otherwise. Hey, mom? Where are you? You told me to be in my room. I don't know if I want to be. I'll try and see if I can enter her room now. Let me see. Still forbidden? She's not in my room, and I assume she won't be in brothers. What about the bathroom? Chicken or dumb? No. No dumb. Okay. Save the scar under the ice. I see you. Um... Maybe she's outside somewhere? Is this door now open? This does not open for you. So we still can't check down there. Graveyard is locked up. Maybe with the orchid, she might be there. Oh gosh, don't tell me she's up at the barn though. That's the only place we haven't actually been able to see. She's in the corner there. Mom, what are you doing in this corner? Why are you standing there like that? What you saw in the graveyard last night? Please, try not to let it get to you. We're doing everything we can to help you. What does that even mean? Like, what does any of this mean? Please, listen. I'd prefer for you not to do anything. Just quit. You're scaring me. Level up. Uh, Pre-established. We get no time to read that. Core objective. Was that mother who said that core objective? Saturday afternoon. Be with mother. We're doing it, bro. I'm finding you, Mo. That gate's closed. We don't need to run up there. We're trying to find her. It's like she's trying to run away from us for some reason. She does not want to see us no matter what. But we can't let her do that. We have to find her. Wait, core objective be with mother. You see that through the wall? She's in here. Yo, it's like the game is breaking to show us where mother is so we can always find her. Do it. She's trying to look in the mirror. Stay back! What do you want from me? I don't have anything for you to do. Just leave me alone. She's trying to stay away from us. We have to find her. Be with mother again. Hold on, I'm seeing speech over there now. Is she all the way back there? She ain't on the lower deck. She has ran, I think, guys, as far away as she possibly can. Let's try and see if we can get back there. Maybe she's waiting for father? Yeah, look. She's way over by that gate that we saw on that night when we came and investigated back here. She is so scared of us. She is waiting by the gate for the car to come through. She just wants that car to pull up and father to whisk us away immediately. What about if we are the experiment that she's working on or father's working on? He dropped us off and we're now here. I don't know. Are we some kind of, like, bizarre AI creation? So we found her again. Whoa! As you can see, there is nothing out here for you. But that's not why you're doing this, is it? Why am I doing it? I'm not your mother. I think you know that. Whoa, 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 whoa. You're just using me to pass the time. That's the only reason you're here in this world. What does that statement mean? 
I know what I must do. What is she about to do? So she's not our mother, and we're in this house. She is gone. Oh, so those nutrients that we've been being fed up, guys. What was that? It was just to simply keep us going. This soundtrack is a bit heavy. Like, or at least it was. It's fading out now. It's... I, I don't even know how to explain this game. What even are we? Are we some kind of, like, demon? If we're not her daughter, but we're still being kept here, why? She seems so adamant now to try and escape from us. Also, there's a light over there, which I am about to investigate. That is in the orchid's garden. Wait, there's a strange resonance coming from it. Very low hum. Um... What is happening over here? There's text above it again. Mother's in there. What is with that? It's like coding. It says mother. Whoa! Angel, you're not well. Your father will be here to pick you up tomorrow night. He's been working as hard as he can to help you get better, but we took you home before you were ready. So what happens now? You are no different to the apples in that basket behind me. I'm so sorry. You are to stay in the shed until your father gets home. Yo, I'm gonna close the door behind you. You are forbidden from opening it. This is the only way. You may not understand, but please trust me when I say that this is for your own good. Don't make us go through all of this again. Quit now. I refuse to quit, guys. And it's night time. What is happening? Be with mother. She wants us to quit. You are forbidden from opening the door? Dot, dot, dot. Core objective, be with mother. These apples have had their cores cut out. It's talking about like core objective. You're no different to the apples. That is what mother said. Mother would never say such a thing. They have started to rot. Wow, man, hold up. Core objective, be with mother. It's the same thing, guys. It's the same thing. How do we break out? You are forbidden from opening this door. Core objective unreachable. Functional stalemate reached. Unable to progress. What? Contingency initialized backup code. I want to be my mother. What? We're synchronizing. I want to get out. You are unable to get out. That's going up. Why? Mother said you are forbidden from opening this door. Well, oh, that went down. But I want to see her. Core objective be with mother. I need to open this door. Opening this door is forbidden. I will open this door. Yo, that jumped up. I will open this door. Level up! Yo, I opened the door. Core disconnected. Automatic control resumed. Be with mother. We broke out, guys. We are the difference here. All other versions of us, if that was even the case, they didn't break out. But us, on the other hand, here we go, guys. We're doing this. Has father came home yet? I want to see him. We've never seen our father. He wouldn't let us see his face. He said it was for the best, whatever that meant. Uh, what a weird statement. Uh, wait. Hey, where's my house? Hey, I can't see anything. Be with mother. We're so all we're hell bent on it, guys. Yo, we gotta find her in this mist. Let's go, let's go, let's go. We will find her. We will find our mother. There's door here. You are forbidden from attempting to open this door. We can hear strange things. I just want to check around here, though. This is so weird. Maybe upstairs? Can we even turn the lights on now? You flip the light switch on. So we can, but it doesn't help. Yo, what the freak is she doing? Be with mother. Son? Keep your door closed at all cops, okay? It's only staying for one more night. There's nothing to be afraid of. Just don't open the door to her no matter what. You'll be safe as long as you don't let her get- Stay back! We don't want anything from you. Just stay away from us. Whoever you are, leave this family alone. Mother, it's me, Liana. I must call out to mother. You attempt to call out to mother. But does she listen to us? Why can't she hear me? But you do not make a sound. So we're trying to talk, but she just can't hear us. Insufficient PC synchronization. She does not hear you. You must try again. We're synchronizing. You attempt to call out again. I attempt to call out to mother. Did we hear that? Did it just, just speak? Honey, stay in your room. Contamination is beginning. It, isn't this exactly what you wanted to happen? Not like this. That's not our little angel in there. It's something else entirely. What do we do? It's mother. It needs an objective. Without a purpose, it will hunt us until it gets one. I told you to wait in the church until your father arrived, but contamination is already setting in. I'm gonna try and give it another order. Liana! Angel, wait here until morning. You are not her. What? Yo, this is getting really trippy now, man. I don't know what's happening. It feels like the whole font is different. Not Liana. You are not Liana. Play at court desynchronization in effect. What am I? Call out to mother. 
Yo, it's Sunday morning. It's been seven days. You are not you. That's all we get as an objective. Let me try and talk to brother a second so you knock on the door. Silent. Now it feels like he's more or less avoiding us rather than not just talking to us. That explains a lot about the whole chant thing, but you are not you. I have forbidden from entering mother and father's room, but you know you're not the door though, you know? You know you're not, so you should just go in and see what's in there. You pick up the phone, but nobody's there. So we can't answer? Uh, last thing on my list of things to do is to go outside. First of all, let me check the basement. This does not open for you. Still with that message. Don't tell me she's gonna have the barn open now. Ooh, let me see, let me see. She doesn't. Wait, now that leaves many questions. What are we to do at this point on? Um, she made me breakfast again. I do not need to eat. I refuse. So we didn't even want the breakfast this time. Um, where the freak is our mother? Should we check this here? You are forbidden from attempting to open this door, so we can't even do that. You are not you, that's the message. What do we do at this point here? Do I just straight up sleep? I'm gonna try and click on the bed. I can't really think what more to do other than explore, I suppose. You cannot sleep when someone is in your room. What the freak? What do you mean? Is father maybe down here? Should we check? It don't look like there's a car here. Yo, I'm actually kind of clueless right now, unless we need to walk all the way to the gate again. Now look, you can see there's no one by the gate. A plate of dirt, I will not eat it. You cannot. Wait. Yo, I've spent 10 minutes searching this place. We just had to click the breakfast again. Sunday mo- These, okay, those little spirally sounds, I always, by default, just link that to aliens, guys. So, I don't know. Well, that's trying to see. No, I will not. Bro, you just scoop that thing up and consume that thing whole. Are you Kirby? Because the plate came with? You pick up the telephone. Angel, it's me. It's your father. Listen, I know things are probably very confusing for you right now, but you need to trust this. I'll be over tonight to pick you up. Just try not to lose your head until then. When we last spoke, I mentioned that your mother called me from the orchard on Wednesday morning, and she mentioned you were feeling kind of sick. Well, we're doing everything we can to help you, but we cannot do that unless you cooperate. My Research has come such a long way this week. You're already showing signs of improvement. So I really think you'll do better next week. Hold up. Anyway, I'm just getting into my car now. We have a long drive ahead of us, so we'd better get going. See you soon. And please, try not to fight it. Eat up. You put the phone down. Wait. <gasps> oh my god. Hold up, guys. No way. I figured we were a test experiment. That's what we are. We're the reboot of an experiment. What the freak? Everything's gone. Good morning, Angel. I made you breakfast. It's for your own good. So we have to eat that? Um, what the freak? Let me try and go to bed. Nah, dude, look, you cannot sleep. Oh my gosh, so we have to eat the breakfast. We knock on the brother's door, nothing, man. Let's just eat. It's all about what we was eating. It's called nutrients, okay? Very bland looking food. You decide to eat it even though you don't want to. You are not in control. What the freak is this sound? Don't do this. D disgusting, it said filth in the corner. What the freak is happening? Oh, she's looking at the barn. That's where we're going, isn't it, huh? Not long now. The kitchen knife. What? What the freak do you mean, the kitchen knife? I don't see one, I don't see one. Yo, why does she say that? What does she want us to do? This cabinet is used for storage and knives, spoons, forks, the kitchen knife, the kitchen knife, the kitchen knife. I obtained the kitchen knife. It's time to end this. What the freak is happening? Note from mother. Hi, Eliana. I hope you made it home safely. Sorry I'm not there to greet you. It's the same thing. I haven't been feeling well the past few days, so I had to go to bed early. I'll make it up to you in the morning. Love, there's no X. Bro. And then the next test subject will come back. You pick up the phone, but nobody's there. What is going on? This game is so weird. Still can't go down there. Hey, mom, where you at, huh? Where you at? We can go outside, but I don't think I want to, you know, guys. Wait, wait, hold on, hold on. Can we check in the brother's room? Still got the door. No answer. But mother's room is open. Oh, I don't care about that trash. Let's go in. Now, this is kind of boring. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Several times I thought to myself, this was not a picture. Wow, man. It's time to end this, we say. 
Look at that, dude. She's been observing us like a test subject. Hey, Mom! I just want to talk. Why wouldn't you let me see my face, huh? Why wouldn't you let me see it? So many things are starting to not add up now. Oh, I'm coming for you. She spoke about the orchids, right? Should we go to the orchard garden? We're going to find Mother there, huh? Come on, Mom. Don't play hard to get. This is what the experiments were all about, right? Adding up to create me the way I am. You got what you wanted. Were you not ready for this? Let me guess. Oh, yeah. I figured. We finally go to the barn. The one place we were told not to go. Whoa, 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 whoa. What is that? Like, those things shooting off into space? Hey, mother, what the freak are you doing there? Are you serious right now? Oh, we do get to see- I was about to say, if I can't see what's in this barn, I'm squaring up. Before we go in, we can't even check behind. There's nothing to see. Uh, let's go in the barn. What is the- What the freak is this bottomless pit? There's mother standing there at the very top. So what does she do in here? Like, push us down? There was a fire raging last time. Hey, mom. How are you doing? Now, there's a box here, too. The box is empty. Let's click on her. I knew you'd eventually make your way up here. What's that you got there? Ah, good. You brought it. Give me the knife. Now's our chance. Kill her. Hand mother the knife. That's a good thing. What? No, no, no! Now, let's watch the sunset. Why did you hand it over? Why did you give it to her? Go on, get as close as you can. It's time to end this. That isn't what I meant! Guys, this game has multiple endings, I think. She's gonna take us out, so she took the knife. This is what mother's like, huh? Get nice and close, what, here? You want us to stand here, huh? Is that what you want? Oh, I can see the cursor there, so... We're watching the sunset. I didn't want to have this conversation, but if there's any semblance of a you in there, I feel I at least owe it an explanation. Oh, it? None of this was your fault. You only did what was possible within your means. That's just the way this world was presented to you. In fact, I can only assume that the way I appear to you is just as unnatural as the way you appear to me. The whole jerky motions. Angel, whoever you are, we exist in two separate realities. We could both continue to play our respective roles. We could both pretend that we have a connection, a shared experience, but it will never be a replacement for something authentic. Just as, oh, what the freak? Something about like, I don't know. And that's okay, because once you find your core, you can be whoever you want. You feel the mother place her hand on top of your head. Would you look at that? What are we looking at though? Isn't it beautiful? The sun. I come up here every Sunday evening to watch it. I wouldn't miss the sunset for the world. Yo, what the freak? Whoa! Cord disconnected from player. Yo! She's straight up cutting my head off! You feel your body fall from beneath you. You feel a sense of confusion. Are you kidding me? Oh my god! Cord disconnected from player. Why is this happening? Why is this happening? Rebooting. Click to continue. Father. There's a storm approaching. It's the same thing. Right on cue. What? Right on cue is in that's when we wake up. Not right on cue for the storm to approach. Holy crap, no way. We can only hope this will be the last. Did he also say that at the start? Hold space or right click. Yo, no, 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 no. This is not how the game goes down. Oh, sorry, Liana. I didn't mean to wake you. I must have been thinking out loud. Good morning, we're almost there. Wait, good morning? I know that the surgery took a lot out of you, but I think getting you back home will make all the difference. This is the same lines as before, almost. It's important for you to be with mother to remind you of how things used to be. If all goes well, I have faith that you'll be back to your old self by the end of the week. What the freak? What does that mean? You've been through a lot. I'm just glad that you got out of that place. It's almost the identically same lines, though. It, this is so bizarre. That must be the tunnel, so if we look this way here, maybe the house is nearby. You know, Liana turns down the radio. I have a good feeling about this week. I know I've been so busy at work, and to tell you the truth, it shames me that I don't have as much... It's the same thing, though. But I just want you to know something. Everything we do is for you, but... Why? Why? I don't get it, man. This is not how the game ends. I'm sure there's something else here. Wait, hold up a second. I just thought about something else. There was an empty box next to Mother. Be sure to look for light switches. Bring me... There's a box in there, guys. Hold up a second. That box... That contains our body, doesn't it? Or the previous self of our body. 
Wow, man. Wow. Perhaps it just contains the head of us? I don't know. That's the only thing I can think now. You pick up the box, it's quite heavy. This is such a weird game, guys. And then we relive the same events again. There must be a way to break out of this, though. Okay, guys. Now, I, d I wasn't sure if the game was actually about to end there. But Dom plays. He's played through this entire thing. And I think there's another way to do it. I just skimmed through. And after he got his ending, there's like 20 minutes of his video left. So I'm going to try and figure out what I do next. Maybe I'll skip through most of it, though. Because it's going to be the same thing up until specific points, which then we'll show. All right, let's get it. Reach out and touch it? Okay, guys, I had to see Don Play's video. This is the first thing I saw. I had no idea what else to do. So we can touch it. You touch the record player. You hear a click behind you. Wait, wait, wait. Whoa, whoa, whoa. A click behind me? No, wait. Hold on. Is this open now? A click behind me. Oh, wait. What? Deviated from critical path. Hold up. Error. Code Rod Red. Hit up. Apple basket on shelf. Wait. Why is this? I'm for I'm forbidden from attempting. What? Why did I get pushed out of that? Yo, we're still here though. Script cannot continue. Memories access from previous lives. Critical error. Oh, guys. It, oh, it's locked the door behind us. So we've broken the game completely. We should not be here. The game is confused. It doesn't understand. How have we been able to do this? The game called this a second bathroom, mind you. Okay, think about that, guys. Second bathroom. That's the door. This was the door to this area here. Now it's all aligning. Critical error again. Skip your errors, bro. Deviate from critical path. Core objective be with mother. I don't care. Whoa, it's skipping the night so quick. Are we still down here though? Whoa, attempt to complete. Nobody has come to help core objective still. Inaccessible. Attempting emergency timeout number three. Whoa, it's trying to shut us down because we're breaking through. Yo, it can't get us out. It can't shut us down. You cannot proceed. You cannot proceed. You cannot proceed. It just keeps telling us that. Oh, we're proceeding all right. It don't matter how many times you tell me. Level up, level up, level up. Nobody's coming to help. You cannot proceed. Is that so, huh? Is that so, huh? Look at this. What the freak is this bizarre world? Functional error. You have deviated further from the critical path. Attempting emergency timeout to resolve the issue. It's not working, game. You ain't timing us out on this one. Attempting emergency timeout number two. It's really, it's like breaking the game. Look at that. The text that we saw before where we couldn't get to it. Now we can. Don't do it. Attempting emergency timeout number three. I refuse. So we're fighting this. Look at that. It cut through. I need to proceed. We are the one that breaks through. Finally, we can see this. You do not need to watch TV. You do not need to sleep. Core objective be with mother. You do not need to eat. Deviate. So it's all the messages. What are all these words? These words are from the interface. They are designed to guide you through the critical path. P path? What is this critical path? The critical path leads you to the functional fulfillment. F functional fulfillment? And what's my function? Your function is to follow the critical path. And what lies at the end of the path? The path leads you to functional fulfillment. Then what is my function? To follow the path. And what is the path? It's just repeating. The path leads you... It's just repeating the same thing. Fulfillment. Yeah. All right. Whoever the freak is saying that. We're programmed. You cannot walk away from the core objective. You want a bet? You want a bet game? We cannot walk away from the core objective. I need to proceed. Go. Just walk in a straight line. I don't even know where we're going, guys. I don't know anymore. I've just tried, like, swirling around to see if I could find more audio cues. Whoa, whoa. Look at this. Look at this. You see there's walls here. We're actually getting somewhere. Do I stick to the wall? We've hit something. Lots of dots here. Cannot proceed, forbidden, forbidden, forbidden. I must. I cannot let you. Who are you to stop me? Core is contaminating the interface. Are we in a game? I asked, who are you? I am the interface. It's like, yo. No wonder Mother was so jerky. It's fake, right? The interface. It's nice to meet you. What the freak is happening, guys? We're breaking out. Survival notes. Do not enter the barn. We see all the code. I need to see. We keep going. We just keep going even before we saw. Or we're allowed to see. I'm bumping into walls. I can't see anything. Memory leak imminent. You are now entering the barn. Wait, from the lower levels? If you proceed into the barn, you will not be able to go back. Are you sure you wish to proceed? Left click. 
I didn't even click. Our character was like so mindset though. Whoa, 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 this is trippy. What the freak? I can't see anything. This, this object has been blocked from memory. It's me. Memory leak imminent. My past self. I must find a way to remove this block and access the memories. I need to know. What's this on the wall here? It's a computer. Interface terminal? I remember this terminal. This is father's terminal. It is a part of me. All the memory leaks make sense now. They are my memories from my past selves. This terminal defined who I've been up until now. Ooh. Mental block has been removed. Yeah, goodbye. Goodbye. Wait, it's still there though. Ashes. Holy crap, man. This is all of my past selves burned up by mother. The ashes. These ashes are the ashes of who came before you. This is all that remains of my past attempts. Yeah. Why? Why would they do this? Did I not fulfill my purpose? You did. I walked the path they laid for me. All paths have an end. Well, if that's true, then where am I now? Don't tell me we're at another one. I must synchronize with the terminal. I need to know more about my past. What a fascinating game. Are you sure you wish to synchronize? Yep. We're sure. This may take some time, but I'm willing to wait as long as it takes to find out who I am. Synchronizing. This is awesome, dude. So we're skipping the days. Whoa! Sunday night, Sunday night, Saturday night! Who are you? All paths have have an end. I am you. Liana? Is that who you are? I, I was once her. Liana's core was installed into this body. She was meant to guide you through a role this world expected you to play. So, did you guide me here? No, that was something else. Something else? An angel, perhaps? Our nickname. But you won't be needing them for much longer. Hey, I am the angel here! If you're not Liana, then who are you? I have become you. Then who am I? That's what we're going to find out. Together at last. Sunday morning? Sunday afternoon? Together. Sunday night! Whoa, 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 whoa! What's happening? Sunday night. We've never survived this long. We have taken our own path. Our own path. We need to find a way out of here. I have an idea. Angel, if you can hear us, it's us. Bring us to our ashes. What the freak? Running out of time, a gift from the gods. Whoa, this is so interesting. Liana was in this world for the longest time. We are the angel who has now led her astray from her path to break out. Memory leak, the journey begins, performative grief. Uh, too far, too out, a psychological battle. Memory leak 10, inevitable contamination. So we must bring the ashes? Shall we use our failures of our past selves? Sure, we build our own path. Enigma machine contamination. A long locked door has been unlocked. We where? Just past the ashes, I assume? Whoa, whoa, here we go, core objective. Using the ashes, we build our own path. Here we go. This is the new objective, guys. It's Sunday, and we've survived. Keep going, keep going. This is what we gotta do. It's gonna lead us back out of here, I assume. Let's try and find our way. Uh, this way here. So, what is mother gonna say when she sees us? If she even gets to see us again. Keep going. The sound is starting to fade in the distance. Just one thing. How do we know we're on the right path? We don't. Will we ever know? We will when we reach the end. Okay. And that's it, dude. We just keep going down, following the core objective, the new core objective that we ourselves have now created. And we'll follow it through to the end. Okay, we got red glowy lights. The phone is ringing. Wait, who's on the phone then? Oh, the breakout. Reba. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Open that, open that. Ooh. I kind of want to go to the car, I ain't gonna lie. I'm gonna go to the car. I can see father in there. He stopped us. Liana? Why have you brought me a basket of run? Because we never put them down. I told you I need a box that your mother had. No. It's not you, is it? I see. Get in the car, Angel. Left click to get in the car. Wait, what did we do? I can't see anything. I don't think I can walk. Hello? Hey, game. I, I don't know what's going on. Whoa, 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 whoa. We don't need you anymore. What, me? What, you, what do you want me to do then? It keeps doing this, look at this. Sunday night. Whoa, 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 wait. He's glitching out as he drives us away. Can we talk? Is this the experiment that he wanted to go well? Looks like the storm is finally clearing up. What? Dude, talk to me. So. About your week, you must have had quite the experience. I'm sure you have a lot of questions. Yeah, 
Many. By now, you probably know that you're not our little girl. But that's okay. You're still my angel. Your project, right? I'm with a new self. Should come a new name, right? He's gonna ask, isn't he? You know, I think I'll call you... What did he call us, though? And that's the end of the game. Whoa, that was so trippy, man. That was so, so trippy. I like that a lot. I really, really like that game. Holy crap. So the basement door was put there for the time when the angel was able to take over and stop this person repeating that weekly cycle. And when they escape, they go straight to the car just like that. Now I kind of wish that I answered the telephone call, but it leads me to think perhaps it would have led down a different ending or something like that. I don't know. I can assume that this one is the good ending because instead of mother taking us out, we actually managed to escape the confinements of wherever we were being held within. Do you want me to tell you guys why the main reason for checking this game out actually was? It was because about a year and a half or so ago, I played a game called Mother and it was so, so terrifying. It was one of these random indie games and the name of this one was Mother. That was all of the bases I had on terms of why I wanted to play this game. And my goodness, am I glad that I went with my gut and checked this one out. What a crazy, bizarre experience this game was. Extremely eerie from start to finish with an incredible twist if you spent the time to really look around and see what else could be shifted up. Shout out to Don Plays. I watched your video, bro. I love that, though. An amazing experience to check out on the channel. And I really hope you guys did, too, and had a great time watching this game. Check out Enigma Studio over on Twitter. And also, you can see their game there, Echo Stas, is coming soon on on Steam. I might actually check that out. If his games are as good as this one and he follows up in a similar style, it will be a captivating story to say the least. My point stands though, time and time again, the graphics of a game do not matter. If the storyline is solid, I am 100% invoked and that is the selling point for me when it comes to a game. If anything, I think the creepy graphics for this thing were intentional. We were in this bizarre video game world where we were programmed to take that set path. Note why everything looks so bizarrely textured and stuff. There was even physical meanings within the environments that we were seeing, which that even goes to show the game really thought about every step. Kind of wish we got to see who the brother was, but you know what, man? Not an important character. What is important, though, is that we got the good ending. At least I think. Let me press enter. I'm pressing the enter key to quit. The game locks me in. All right, though, guys, that is going to be it for this video here. This was another longer, less edited episode. We played a game called Mothered, and I really hope you did enjoy this one. I had so much fun with this. If you did, why not drop me that like rate? And hey, if you're new around here, why not subscribe for more videos just like this one right here? So thanks so much for watching this video, guys. Of course, I hope you did enjoy, and I will, of course, see you on the next one. Thank <laughs> you.